Then Elio Rodriguez is uh, going to meet Kevin Lee and he hooked in as a replacement at UFC Vegas uh, 3-5. That to say that uh, Daniel D. Rodriguez, 6 foot tall, 74 inches is his rich, great southpaw fighter, fighting out of uh, Tap Out LA. Right now he is BMF Ranch fighter. 15 2 D. Rod riding on a row, the former Smash Global welterweight uh, champ once. And uh, that to say that in UFC he is having really great records. He choked out Team Means, outworked Gabriel Green. Mike Perry stopped Dwight Grant and Preston Parsons, and he was outworked by Nicholas Dalby. D Rod is a fearsome striker and a great finisher, fair on the ground. I would even dare to call him good all around fighter, but this time I believe he's going to have the greatest test of his career as he's slated to fight Kevin Lee. 5'9, 77 inches is Lee's reach, which means Rodriguez is going to face impressive 3 inch. I reach this advantage and uh, Kevin Lee is fighting out of Montreal, Quebec, so uh, I got to say 18-6 is his score. Kevin Lee is a top-notch wrestler, but he lost uh, four matches in his last six outings. He stopped at Sumber Bowles and Gregor Gillespie, but prior to that he was choked out by Tony Ferguson, Charles Oliveira, Rafael Dos Sainz, and outworked by Ali Quinta. so Kevin Lee's uh, submission game is pretty much solid, but he was finished on numerous occasions. I believe Lee is a better wrestler than Rodriguez, but I would give stamina advantage to Rodriguez. I really think uh, Rodriguez has very, very good stamina. And I think Rodriguez has uh, better finishing ability, but it's going to be very, very hard to pick a side here. Especially considering the fact this is the clash of two different fighting styles. Also, if the fight goes the distance that should go in the favor of Rodriguez, but it's so, so hard. So, I have to say that uh, Daniel Rodriguez is better clincher also, better striker, and a better knockout artist also. And uh, for this one, I'm going to go with uh, the fight uh, not going the distance. That's going to be my pick number one, and if I have to pick a side, my picking a side would be... Hmm, that's a hard one. Yeah, I'm going to fight, fight not going the distance. I think I'm going to go with D-Rod when I pick a side. So I said D-Rod wins.